Former owner of a once popular amusement park in Rockford wants to hear from people who love going to Kitty Land. Betty Denson is about to turn 96. 23 News reporter Sydney Stoffreg and talks with Betty's granddaughter who hopes to make this birthday something to remember. I do remember the cotton candy was a special thing. It might be hard for some people to believe this cold, empty land in Rockford was once an amusement park with thrilling rides and adventures. For those who do remember, it's a sweet memory. But Kitty Land is more than that for former owner Betty Denson. It's a piece of her heart. She really loved watching all the people come and make memories themselves. She loved that her kids were able to grow up there. She really you know, she's like me. She liked to see people happy. Granddaughter Carrie Scotty says her grandmother will soon turn 96. She asks anyone who fondly remembers the Adventure Park to write a letter and let Betty know what the place meant to them. Kurt Lewis says his family visited on special occasions. His favorite ride mimicked a helicopter. My mom would always dress us up to go ride there. I think it was called the bullet. Riding with my dad and as little as we are, I always felt like I was going to fall through. Yeah, it was it was fun. I, it's a shame that there's not something like that still right now. Carrie got the idea for the letters from a Facebook post about Kittyland. She says community feedback has been incredible. The impact that they had on so many other people's lives growing up, especially during the times that it was, you know, it just it feels really good to be a, genetically a part of that. You know, we really are all about making people happy. Working for you in Rockford, Sydney Stoffregan, 23 News. Looked like a lot of fun yeah, back in the day, for sure. If you'd like to share a memory and make Betty's birthday even more special, you can find the address at WIFR.com.